Now to a 13 News exclusive in a case with sensational accusations attracting global attention. Yeah, at the heart of it, Indiana parents accused of neglecting their adopted daughter. They said she was an adult posing as a child, and they say she threatened to hurt them. A jury in Tippecanoe County found the father not guilty. Earlier today, I spoke with the dad. That's Michael Barnett in his first interview since that recent verdict. I can breathe. I haven't been able to breathe in, in, a, in a very long time. After years of public and legal wrangling, Michael Burnett learned that the jury reached a verdict in Lafayette on October 27th. They deliberated for just over two hours. One hour of that was lunch, so it, it didn't take them long. Perhaps that decision came so quickly because Barnett's attorney, Terrence Kennard, whittled down that felony neglect case to a single argument. The truth is, Michael did not abandon his adult child. That was the only question I presented to the jury. I stayed away from all the other things, and I said, here's the facts. The state of Indiana says he abandoned his adult child. Did he? And the jury said no. Full stop. That jury never heard some of the more salacious accusations. I guess it comes down to whether or not you are an evil psychopath demon child that's come over here to murder everybody. Natalia Barnett told Dr. Phil she was neglected at 16, has dwarfism and scoliosis. They claim that they did bone scans and all that. But in I an earlier case, an Indiana court determined that Natalia, born in Ukraine, was in fact 23 when she was left alone in Lafayette. What was it like when you saw the Dr. Phil show? Didn't watch it. Why? I don't watch any of that stuff. I haven't watched myself on TV. You didn't watch when you were on Dr. Oz or Inside Edition? Nope. You're kidding. No. I have never, I've never ever, ever watched any of those things front to back, ever. And coverage in this case may continue because the calls don't stop. The media from a far away is Japan, China, Australia, the UK. Uh, it, this case garnered the attention of the world. The trial for Burnett's ex-wife, Christine, is now set for April. He could be ordered to testify. I would say that is not Michael's desire to do so, uh, but that'll be up to the courts. After our interview, Barnett shared these shots from when Natalia was first adopted. It's when he thought she was six. Adding her to the family was a dream that he now says almost destroyed him. Knowing that this major part of this is, 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 is over, Amory, I have faced the most ridiculous, trying, um, malicious, difficult thing, and I'm okay. Certainly feeling like a survivor today. Hulu bought Michael Barnett's life rights for an option on a series, potentially eight episodes, to tell his story. He is now using those proceeds to help pay his legal bills.